Hi, I'm Michelle, and this morning we're talking to Dr. Annika Schrader from Beisdorf. Annika, thanks for coming in today. Yeah, you're welcome. Annika, could you tell me a bit about how long you've been at Beisdorf and what your role is there? Yeah, I joined the company in 2005 for my PhD, which I finished in 2008. And afterwards, um, I got a job as a so-called research scientist. And last year, I became a lab manager of the lab, which is called Dry Edge Skin. So my focus, my research focus is on dry edge skin. So how long would the research and development of a product take? Oh, um, it depends on the project because we have some so-called short-term projects, which at least takes around about one year. And we have some very long-term projects, which at least can take up to eight or ten years. So it depends on the results and on the research. So sometimes you have to develop a very new method, for example, and this can take up to five or five, five or six years at least. So, Annika, we've heard Nivea has introduced a Nobel Prize-winning discovery to develop a skincare breakthrough. Can you tell us a bit about the discovery? Yeah, of course. So it was Peter Acri who was um, the one who could show that we have little little channels in the cell membrane and the cell membrane is a kind of a border of a cell. So it protects um, the cells from the environment and normally nothing is able to get through the cell membrane. So we wondered how is water going through the cell membrane, through the cell border. So he thought, well, there must be some kind of transporters or pores. Yeah, and he could show that there are water transporters, and he could show this in 1998. So where does the water come from? Um, actually, um, human skins have um, the so-called dermis, and there you have all these blood vessels, and the blood vessels are filled up with water, so they get moisturized from the deeper layers, from the dermal part. Um, but in the epidermal part, you don't have these blood vessels, so we wondered how is water transported from these deeper layers up to the epidermis and so we guess well maybe we have these aquaporins too so that was the point where we started to investigate aquaporins in human skin. So what does it mean if your skin has more aquaporins? Well if you have more aquaporins in your skin it means you have a improved distribution of water from the deeper layers so it's an improved um, moisturization, it's a kind of skin's own moisturization. So this is a big advantage because it's skin's natural way to hydrate itself. And we can improve this by having this nice active hydro IQ, which is able to, to increase the number of the aquaporins. So at least we can improve skin's own hydration. Annika, how does hydro IQ create a more effective body moisturizer? Well, um, Hydra IQ is able to stimulate skin's own production of aquaporins and um, yeah, it's, it's very natural. So um, yeah, it improves skin's hydration by building up these pores and improves the distribution of water in human skin. So if you want to create a very, very well, a very good moisturizer, you have different possibilities. The first thing is to, to put skin moisturizer in the cream, glycerin for example, um, or you can improve the skin barrier so that you can keep all the water in the skin. But this is only something against the symptoms, so it's against um, scales and against itch. And HydroIQ is able to really address the cause of, um, of skin dehydration. I think it's, it's very important to use glycerin as well. So you have um, something very, yeah, which is very fast against the symptoms, against itch, etc. But this is more long-term threatening of, of skin's dehydration. So. And it's a, it's a really exciting development for the Nivea range. Will Hydra IQ be used in any other products? Yeah, of course. As you can imagine, it is so an important discovery to figure out that the skin has these aquaporins and we have an active to improve the amount of aquaporins. And I guess you can imagine that for every product which deals with skin moisturizations might be very interesting. So I guess there are some projects to come. When women use Nivea's moisturizers that contain Hydra IQ, what changes can they expect to see to their skin and in what time frame? Well, um, of course they can see an improved skin appearance very fast. So it means you get a well hydrated skin, um, you get less um, scaliness, less itch, um, yeah, and you get a more yeah, like an even skin tone, I guess. So these are the most imp important factors and yeah, I guess you can see it after maybe a week if you apply it twice a day, yeah. And I heard the Hydra IQ can work on the skin for three days. 
up yeah. to three days. Yeah. So it will continue to stimulate. Yeah, it means if you use a product um, continuously and you stop using it, you can see this this brilliant um, brilliant hydration up to three days after you stop to using the product. Yeah. Thank you so much, Annika, for coming in to talk to us today at Beauty Directory TV. You're welcome.